late one afternoon, we pulled up under some shade trees and observed some animals. An Inyala cow and her two youngsters soon entered the meadow. Oh, it's beautiful here with the wind right. Everything's perfect. Let's just give it a few minutes here and just watch what comes out of that forest there. Great. Big ball, big ball. I see him. Yeah, he's a shooter guy. Absolutely, he's. The minute I saw him, I knew that. Okay, we'll let him come out. Ooh, he looks good. When he stops and you're ready, you can take the shot. Oh, he's magnificent. He looks so good in the scope. Ready? Yep. Nice shot. Oh, man. Excellent. He went right down there. Excellent. I feel good about that. The, uh, the vertical stripes on the body, you know, that's a magnificent characteristic of the animal. Um, hold that gun there for a second. Let me uh, pull that head up. And then the magnificent spiral horns. Is that a pretty good trophy? Yeah, he is. He's an old bull. Look at his bases, how thick and worn they are. He's yeah. thrashing trees and branches here. Um, no, he's a nice, he's a very nice representative bull for the area. Yeah, he's got a nice twist and then uh, comes up into some real thick, nice polished tips. And then, of course, uh, the other characteristic is the chevron marking on the nose there. Uh, the kudu has that, the inyala has that. Uh, you know, of all the uh, uh, spiral horned antelope of uh, Africa, I'd say the kudu and the inyala are two of the most spectacular. Take a look at his legs and look at the socks, what they would be called socks here. They were the dark charcoal gray, mm -hmm. and then from the knee going down, that fawn colored look, and he's a little bit muddy, but maybe on the back you can see here. There you go. That. Pretty hair, it's nice contrast. Yes, I am uh, very pleased with this animal. Thank you again for a nice encounter. Beautiful opportunity to visit with an Inyala and take a big bull. My pleasure, Buck.